Hello, and welcome to the very last part of this, uh, this weird devlog video. Uh, as you can see, the time is 8.17. Everything's all been uploaded, I uploaded it earlier, so... Heck and Harry, it's uploaded. Everything, it's here. Uh, let me just, as you can see, it's submitted to Game Jam. Uh, yeah, I think it went alright. Uh, at the end, there was a bit of a rush. I'll show you now what what we end up doing. Uh, I ended up going to sleep uh, after the last episode because I was just fucking shattered. I feel like working on this just drained me. The design docs. Uh, there are some different resources here that I didn't end up using. Not this one. This one gave me like a cool idea. But sadly, it didn't have what I was looking for. Not that. The sands. Uh, what did I pick for the logo? Ah, I didn't end up using any of this, sadly. I, in theory, should have. But, oh well. So I got my to-do list. So it was, uh, tell the player, pad open the menu, which is Q. Pause menu, resume quit, movement, game mechanics. I don't know if all these are game mechanics, but it was sort of just in my head to break it down and make it more simple if I knew what had to be done. Uh, so yeah, play was safe for 10 seconds after doing the hack, so boop, the hack would go off. Uh, put that as a green as well. And then they had 10 seconds to, to survive. So moving platforms, death traps, spawns, timer, uh, and game over screen as well I did. Level design, linking levels. Sadly, I only ended up doing a level 1 and level tutorial. This is the biggest area that I need to need to work on. Just for the whole fact that geez, uh, oh yeah. for some reason I decided to spend so little time on making levels than anything else which which shot me in the foot in f to be fair because uh, yeah I made a basic tutorial where you're jumping over a few things and the first level I thought was actually pretty good again I could have done way better and play test it but I think that is down what should I do uh, let me just move this uh, is it post mortem like that that'll be for me later uh, well let's do it now uh, level design. So what were we? Level design, main menu stuff, all cool. The cool screen in my head, I wanted to have like again, I guess we'll open this. Like all this sort of stuff, like something moving or something, something around to make it feel a bit more alive. Just so it was a bit more, a bit more something. I'll show you the game after I finish looking at all this. Uh. But yeah, art, I, character, so character art, all I did is just put material on it, like a glowing green material. Uh, world objects, again, I just put texture on them. Uh, post, uh, post processing, or processing, slash the juice, you know that, that pop, that make the game pop even more. I wasn't able to put the camera effects that I wanted to, I wanted to put that like gain effect, make it all like crack and look like a screen, I wanted to put that, I don't know what it's called, we'll op open up the engine now, and we'll, we'll figure out what it's called, but, yeah. Lastly, music and sound, did not put any music in, so let's just put music there, and read that up, because we didn't do that. Uh, didn't accept sound, a death sound, a pause, a menu sound, and a hack sound. I think they came out pretty well. Uh, levels. Uh, let's start from the main menu. Right. Let's hit play. And I'll sort of talk through my process of, of half of this stuff. So as you can see... Let's see if I ah I'll hmm. minimize that a bit. There we go. So as 
So what we got here, main menu screen. So it's got like all this stuff. The idea was to have some like stuff moving around. I don't know, like moving around here or like a picture here, or just this code to like constantly type different stuff. So you got a little click phone. So here's the character. I put a camera lag so it's like a bit woo. So you can see I've textured these walls and put a material on it. I think it's turned out pretty well. These boxes as well, I've put like this weird screen effect on so they look a bit weird. As you can see, I got a timer on the top right. <coughs> Terminal. Oh, so there. The hack's taken place. I've put an error in. So now. Boom. And then you find for a few more seconds. Uh, ah. It's still tab to escape. Shit, that is annoying. But yeah, so tab does this and then you can go like shut down, takes you back here. And back in. But let's just absolutely speed run this. But yeah, this is like the tutorial level where it sort of just brings you in. This is real bright here. I wanted to put some. See my mouse. I wanted to put some stuff in the background, but didn't end up doing that. It looks just real bright and empty. So you come in and you're like, oh, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I can't go this way. run all the way back here and then you jump up these to jump around <coughs> oh shit so one of my ideas as well is these would like <coughs> fall or like delete after you had landed on them or well, let's see if I can get into like a safe place before this. No. But yeah. Ooh. But yeah, I think it, it like turned out a well. I like okay at, at the end of the day. It took me two days to make this with not much unreal knowledge. I say that, I've, I've been working on Unreal for like two months, the last last few days, but making it... Making a game is, in that, in that amount of time, is something, something else entirely. Let's speed, jump in. Ooh. Fuck. But oh well. Uh, let's just wait down the the timer. So as the timer goes down, and you can see all the texture on the side. I think like some of the textures have turned out pretty well since I'm no artist at all. So I'm hoping. Oh, as you can see as well, that each different number I type is a different code. Yeah, I think I needed more stuff in the background because it's too white and open at the moment. Like it just is too too bright, you know. I guess. Uh, I'm definitely planning on going back and fixing some of the stuff. But let's just wait for the, the timeout thing. Game over at a time. And I'll wait a few seconds and then we'll... Oop. Set you back here. But yeah, I think overall it turned out pretty well. Uh, game is all uploaded.
some of the bugs we were running into. These were the main bugs I put down. Um, level design. Uh, we'll put more, more levels and more. Deed. Jeez, I can't talk. More detail. But yeah, either way, it's all all that matters. Uh, I need to update this page, but I think for two days. Ah, I'm pretty chuffed with myself. Like, for not ever releasing a game to doing one in two days. With... With everything that's going on. I'm... I don't know. I think it went well. Uh, hopefully people enjoy it. And all that sort of stuff. I am now going to go... Because I watched that Ubisoft event. I think that's on now. And then also go for a shower. Because, jeez warm as anything outside and it's a bit a bit hot and sweaty in this room from coding and doing other game stuff but thank you for watching hopefully you get a chance to download the game let us know what you think let us know what i could improve on anything really like any feedback or criticism is good criticism at the end of the day as long as it's constructive even if it's not constructive, at least then I know, okay, cool, they didn't like it. And then try and figure out what they didn't like. But thanks for watching, and hopefully I'll release some more videos, or I'll even release these. But we'll see. Anyway, I'm rambling now. Uh, thanks for watching, and catch you guys later. Peace.